afternoon, Stamper. Today I'm going to show you something new that I learned not long ago. It's called Black Magic. Some people call it Black Magic with a twist. First, you're going to start. Your image going to look just the white. This is the second. That would be just Black Magic. And then when with the twist, it's where you see the little white polka dot there. And here's another card Whoops, that I did too, like that. So what you're going to need, you need black cardstock, craft ink pad in the white, and you need your watercolor crayons, uh, not crayons, pencil. Not the crayons, but the pencil. So the first thing you want to do is stamp your image with the white craft ink. And then this here, you have to let it dry. To speed up the process, you can use your embossing gun and um, eat set it. But I have started one, so I can show you from start to finish. So this is just with the white craft ink. You would have to let it dry. Then you're going to take your crayon and color. And I started a little bit. I didn't want to bore you all day with my coloring. And you need like in the pink, you're going to color it with a lighter one, and we're going to highlight it with a darker one. And it's the same with the green. Here it is. And you don't have to go right on the line because we're going to do the highlight with the darker color. After you're done with the coloring, you're going to take the darker one, and I'm using the purplish on this, and I'm just going to outline my flower all around it. Even if you see some white, that's okay. It gives some character a little bit. So I'm going to finish the outline here. Just bear with me. Um, I really don't know who came up with this first technique. I think it's a Karen from what I read, but I'm not sure. But of course, I copy it, I saw it, and now I'm going to share it with you. That's what called casing. And then the green, I already did my leaves in the green. I'm going to come with the darker one, and I'm just going to highlight it on the side. Here we go. And I'm going to do it the same with my stem. Put my stem um, kind of uh, brownish there, and my daughter said, Mom, it have to be green. I said, oh, don't worry. By the time I'm done, they're going to be kind of greenish. Okay, so that would be just black magic right here. What I'm going to do, I'm going to add a little bit more color on this one. Now you're going to take your gel pen. And remember, you don't shake a gel pen because then it uh, get bubbles when it don't write good anymore. You just tap it. And then I'm going to add the white here. I'm going to add white in the center of my flower. And then you just add little drops on the top. And that's what they call the black magic with the twist. And I'm going to do the same on my leaves there. Here we go. So now I'm going to finish my card. It's going to be mounted on the green, and I don't know what other color I'm going to put in the back. I bet it's going to be eggplant. But now you know how to do the black magic. Hope that this interests you, and you're going to get your stamp out and go have some fun. Happy stamping. Till the next time.